strange. This woman claims to have given birth to a python, to that snake you're seeing in the video. In her home country, Uganda, there are many strange beliefs that a person can give birth to many things. There are beliefs that people have given birth to rivers, to wells, and many, many other things. So if you enjoy this video, kindly give it a thumbs up and leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. I also have a question for you guys, especially for those who come from African countries. Do these kind of beliefs appear in your cultures, in your home countries? Kindly leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. I'll be so happy connecting with you. In December 2017, this lady was pregnant with two twins and unfortunately during that year, she lost her husband. She was just like any normal woman with pregnancy. She didn't get any complication and she felt everything was good inside her womb with her two fetus. When her pregnancy was due, she was rushed to the hospital but as they were going to the hospital, the first child came out as they were walking through a plantain on their way to the hospital. The first child was a python. All people around were so shocked and most of them ran away from her. But one of the people remained around and helped her during that time. But as of now, the woman says that she has been abandoned by her own family from her side and from the husband. She's also experiencing a lot of problems with the community because in this video, they had reported her to the wildlife center and they had come for this snake. But she pleaded with the wildlife officials saying that this is my child. Child, please don't take him away from me. The Mozala Elans of Locum Labidom, the Talimedi Bans Kiddies, the Ranga, and Basavanga. The woman continued saying that she's been abandoned by men as well. Men no longer want to be with her because they fear having snakes as children. The other twin child is a girl, and right now she's in school. Talking about what the snake eats. The mother said that she feeds him with 40 eggs per day and every after two days she brings meat for her child. We kumbo gobaganya kubuli saidi. Eye wafe, eye wamami, ze sirina mkwani. Buli mtu wagambo mkazo yazalo mchi. Umusota yazalo mchi. Elanga wagambe chimu, chuchikule kule fede chuchikula chimu. Ula wagamba tindalo mkwagala na yata zalo umusota. But this brings me to ask a question, guys. What do you really think of this? Leave your thoughts in the comment section down below and I'll be so happy discussing this issue.